Hi, let's talk about automation, specifically working your way out of a job. I recently heard a quote that says, if you are working like a robot, a robot will take your work. People tend to think that that quote means that if you have repetitive tasks at your day job, if you are bagging groceries or scanning products or doing something that is very repetitive like that, that eventually a robot will be created to do it for you. And a lot of people are upset about that. They're concerned that their jobs are going away, that they'll have to retrain, that the economy is shifting. While that's all probably true, as entrepreneurs, we can rejoice in the fact that automation can help us stop doing so much work. Overwhelmingly, I see entrepreneurs who are passionate about the work that they're doing and love what they do as well. And so they end up working really hard for really long hours and doing a lot more work than they ever should be doing in the company. The fact is that technology is increasingly able to handle many complex jobs. Things as simple as scheduling, things as complex as data collection and analyzing. There are amazing, amazing opportunities that we have with technology, and a lot of them can be done for cheap or for free for your company. Automation will open your time as an entrepreneur. With more time, you can create more opportunities for your company and more income, greater profitability, bigger profit margins, and even expanding to hiring employees. But if a robot could take your job, if your job is very repetitive, why would you want to give that job to somebody else, another human, when you could be using their skills and their talents in a more complex and interesting way, a way that will be more interesting to them? Why would you want to pay someone to do something that tech could do really easily? This episode isn't designed to talk about getting people out of work or getting entrepreneurs away from hiring. In fact, I want you to hire and I want you to be able to hire well. And the first step to hiring well and to scaling your company is automation. The more that you can outsource to technology, either for free or for cheap, the more time, the more expansion, the more you can do in your company, which means that you can give interesting work to your future employees and you can move forward confidently knowing that your work is going to be even more productive. You shouldn't be spending time sifting through data, sifting through your inbox, wondering if you need to follow up with so-and-so, trying to rethink that process or system. Technology can do all of this for you. You won't become the CEO that you deserve to be and that you want to be the leader that you envision yourself as if you are in the slog of work that is so simple that technology can do it. If you're confused about automation or how to use it in your business, I created a guide called the Scaling Blind Spot Finder and it will help you know exactly where in the scaling process you are with your company and what to do next. And there's a whole section on automation because automation is really the first step and it's really important that you get it right so that you can move forward and confidently scale your company without spending extra time or money doing things that you really shouldn't be doing. And if you're already on your automation journey, comment below, share the tools that you've found that really have worked for your business and even have transformed your company. What was a big shift for you? For me, the first thing I automated in my tech company was scheduling and it changed everything. I'd love to hear what technologies, what apps, what tools you feel have changed everything for your company. And I know others will value it too. See you later.